Coding data in S1 can seem really complicated, but it's not. If you look at this data set here, from 220 to 320, we can see that the mean is 270. To get that, we'd have to add them all up and divide by 8, because there are 8 numbers. But why do we even bother coding it then? First of all, coding is useful if you're going to program computers, but it's also useful for turning quite difficult three-digit numbers into much simpler two-digit or even single-digit numbers. Let's see how we do that. Let's take this code here on the left, x take away 200. What do we have to do there? Well, it's quite self-explanatory because we simply take away 200 from each of the data. So 220 take away 200 is 20, and you get a new data set. Then we could find the mean of that data set and we'd find out that it's 70. What about this coding here, x divided by 10? Don't worry about the y, that's just your answer. x divided by 10. Well, if we divide each of these by 10, 220 divided by 10 is 22, 240 divided by 10 is 24, etc. And if we find the mean of this data, we'd find it's 27. Now you may have noticed something already. If we go backwards from the coding to our mean, we'd get back to the original. So for example, 27, if we times it by 10, we get back to the mean of the original data, 270. But we never even had to work out the mean of the original if we just use this coding data. So it can be quite a neat trick. The mean of this data is 70. And if we added 200, we get back to 270. What about a more complicated one? Here we had to take away 200 and then divide by 10. But look at the results. Look how simple those numbers look. 220, if you take away 200 and then divide by 10, just becomes 2. And same for the rest of the numbers. Find the mean of this and you get 7. And again, the same trick applies. If we wanted to go backwards, we do 7 times by 10 to get 70 and add 200 to get back to the original mean of 270. And it was a lot easier typing this into the calculator than it was typing the original numbers in. It was a lot quicker. How about this? This looks like an exam kind of question. Data is coded using the code y equals x take away 7.5 divided by 5. The mean of this coded data is 34.5. Find the mean of the original data. Well, by now, you might see that what you need to do is reverse the coding to get back to the original. So instead of dividing by 5, and by the way, you always start with the reversing the dividing, we're going to times by 5. So we do 34.5 times by 5. How do we get rid of the takeaway 7.5? Well, we would add 7.5, 180. And that is how you use coding.